The fashion trend that needs to die are tiny sunglasses because my potato face cannot wear them and look good, so I don't want anybody else looking good. They don't look good on anyone. Right, Except right. supermodels. Yeah. The fashion that needs to die is a latex dress because just mm. no. It's and hot. Boob sweat, your self tanner is rubbing off. You're it falling out like of this. You're just like it's spilling not. out everywhere. We have to hide our nipples. It's so Unless you're thing. face tuning, it's not going to look good in a photo. The fashion trend that needs to die is trying to dress up a sweatpant. It's a sweatpant. My fashion regrets are anything from 2009, and if you'd like to see them, just Google my name. Yeah, this is a tough time for you. Bleached hair, black eyeshadow, it was good. You had like a leopard hair for a moment. I did, I had little chunks of black, I had a studded belt. I had tiny sunglasses too. Of course you did. For me, it's when I thought like a pump and a jean mini skirt with like a low slung belt, not in the belt loops was it. Yeah, but what about an Ugg and a jean mini skirt? I never had an Ugg. Oh, I did those were expensive and I was poor. Thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> My biggest fashion regret, it was a bang. Yeah. I had bang regrets. Yeah. So what she's saying is she's never regretted anything she wears because she's chic AF, but she had bangs once. Never been dumped. <laughs> never been broken up with either. Except by Sean McVay. Sean McVay dumped me, but. He's rich as <laughs> now. Becca's personal style is boss ass powerful bitch. Yes. Yes. She wants to be in a blazer. She wants to be in a pant. She never wears anything tight. Modest mop. chic. Yeah, yeah. It's like, like she's a high Amish. neck. I like to be covered. At least to the knee. You can't yes. show knees. She's like Drake in a Drake video. Like a turtleneck and then an accessory and then a blazer with a shoulder pad. I don't want to see anyone's skin after 30. Sorry. Jack has a very, very I would call her style underwear optional. <laughs> yes. We yes. had to actually teach Jack how to wear a bra when we got our television show on E! because she didn't own any. Yeah. Still not wearing one. Are you not wearing one? No. <laughs> <laughs> Jack not loves wrong. a crop top. She's never worn a full shirt in her life. Mm -mm. Not once. Mm -mm. She loves a high slit. That goes up to her ribs. Yep. Hmm. One time um, I saw her in a lace bodysuit and a boot. <laughs> at Coachella. It was a good look. And a yeah. cape. I stand by it. Yeah, yeah you can do a bodysuit as long as you have a cape. You just have to like put the fabric somewhere else can where you? it's lacking somewhere. I'm not sure you can. Kelty's style is anything free. <laughs> she loves a gift from anyone. I was gonna say, Kelty's style is literally nothing because you'll just put on anything that anybody is like, Kelty, wear this. You're like, okay. I'm yes. like the Gigi Hadid of the Lady Gang where everything looks good on me. <laughs> <laughs> it's the haircut. Talk to Gigi. Her name's not Gigi. It might be. Have you ever spoken to Yolanda? I have. Hey guys, make sure to subscribe here because you're gonna see clips from our show and ultra exclusive content that's only gonna live here for Lady Gang. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What are we gonna do? Subscribe. Right here. Subscribe.